everyone we're going to be reviewing a camping product we just recently purchased it's a igloo bmx 52 52 quart cooler and it comes in tank green and orange uh, this is a look at of it never been used purchased it a few months ago we're going to be taking it on a three-day camping trip or four-day three-night camping trip in the middle of July and the temperature is going to be in the low 90s so it's going to get tested out fully so what I like about it from the get-go I love the color scheme it matches my Lumacraft boat perfectly and uh, just an awesome color scheme and uh, the sidewalls seem to be fairly thick. I like the handles. The handles are very sturdy. And I like this little wire here that keeps the cooler lid from going back too far. And also these latches. I really like these rubber latches. Alright, so what we're going to be packing in the cooler and trying to keep cold over the next three days, three hot July days is a couple of sausage patties, uh, 16 count of hot dogs, um, a couple packages packages of sausage links, some condiments, uh, about a dozen and a half of eggs, some sliced cheese and some cheddar cheese, some burger patties, some shredded lettuce, coleslaw, and some butter, and some condiments, ketchup, mayo, mustard. Uh, all we're going to use to cool the cooler are going to be these three freezer packs. Hopefully that'll be enough. And uh, everything's frozen, so all the meat's frozen. So we'll see how it does. Alright, the cooler's packed. And actually, I ended up adding uh, four frozen bottles of water in uh, just for extra cooling because uh, those freezer packs may not be enough like I said I've never used this cooler before so this will be the first time and I'll put some marshmallows in here also since I had the extra space I might throw a couple more items in the top that don't necessarily have to be kept cold but since I have the extra room this cooler is pretty roomy it's a lot of food in there and it's still a lot of space but uh, with the four freezer packs and these four bottles of water I think this will stay cold the entire camping trip but we will, we will see. After one day, let's see where we're at. Looks like the ice bottles, the frozen water bottles, are more than half melted. The freezer packs, the chill packs, they're still frozen, so that's good. So after one day, looks like it's doing pretty well. All right, third day, and I ended up having to break down and go get some ice. <clears throat> the freezer pack's still frozen, but and there's a little bit of ice left in them, but not much. And I didn't want my food spoiling, so the ice that I put in, I put in late yesterday afternoon. Temperatures have been in the mid 90s, really, really hot, and the ice is holding up pretty good. So day number three, ice packs weren't quite enough, but uh, looks like uh, it did a pretty good job considering I didn't put much in there to cool everything and as hot as it is. All right, so we made it back from our camping trip, uh, four days, three nights, mid nineties for the temp, very hot, very humid. Uh, some of the days are upper nineties. In the evenings it got down to upper 70s so really wasn't much relief at any time um, this cooler did pretty well considering what we put in it to cool with everything that was frozen all the meat was frozen when we loaded it um, and of course we had the four freezer packs and the four bottles of water on the third day we did add some ice because we didn't want to take the chance of our stuff spoiling uh, that last uh, evening and day so we did add about half a bag of ice um, everything was still cold uh, some of the meat was still frozen at that point which I think is really really good um, 
So we're pretty happy with it. I think this is a really good buy. I purchased this from Bass Pro on sale. It was uh, $99 before taxes. And of course I got free shipping. Um, they normally sell for $175. So that was $76 off, really good deal. Uh, right now they're currently $175 uh, through them, but I'm sure you can find them elsewhere for a better price. I'll link uh, Amazon for this product and uh if you're interested in picking it up but i'm happy I, I wouldn't say it's as good as a yeti cooler but it's not far from it um if you're able to get it on sale like i did for 99 dollars, that's an incredible deal um 175 i think is a little bit pushing it but it, it's a mid-level cooler so it did its job i'm very happy i'll use it again i, I kind of wish i would have bought two at that price but uh it's kind of too late for that. But anyways, we do recommend it. Uh, great product. Uh, wish I would have bought two or three of them. But uh, click the link in the description. Like our channel, please, and share us. Uh, and uh, subscribe. We hope you come back. We'll have a lot more content in the future. Uh, for now, peace out and have more fun camping.